Mm. All right, so when you're making blood, the classic is they would take Cairo syrup, ah. right? Because it's thick. Yeah, and so you'd take Cairo syrup and a little bit of food coloring, and this blood. was supposed to be. Now, it looks horrible. It yes. doesn't look like blood. No, it looks like Cairo it's, syrup. It's horrible, yeah. all right? No. So, so, but we know that the Cairo syrup is a good thickening agent, and if you want to whiten it just a little bit, cornstarch is the trick. Really? So, so it's not as uh, transparent, and blood is not completely transparent. And believe it or not, Hershey syrup will help kind of darken it a little bit. And so here's what I thought we would do. You grab the blender, and let me show you how to make blender blood, all right? So, blender uh, blood. So why not? So I went to the store, and as I was looking through, fruit punch looks a whole lot like blood. So you just start with some fruit punch. So this looks pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is looking pretty good. But you know it's way too watery, so what do we add to thicken it? We add Cairo syrup. Nice job. So okay. a little bit of Cairo syrup. That's going to be a perfect amount right there. Got it? All right. Boop. Yes. Now, that by itself is not going to look very good. So we're going to want to darken it a little bit with some food coloring. Okay. So now we darken it with our food coloring. Red food coloring. And mm -hmm. believe it or not, that the, uh, the, the Hershey syrup does a really, really good job with mixing this up. I would not, so, I guess brown, but I wouldn't have guessed that syrup. Of course, it's a good consistency. Exactly. So here we go. So, okay. So far too red. See how red that is? Oh, yeah. All right. So we want to oh, darken geez. that. So we're going to take some Hershey syrup and we're going to shoot some of that oh, in there. So there this we go. is going to look Another red. exact amount exactly, there. Exactly. So, right? Because right? this is a little playing. It just. Oh, oh better. Did you look at that? Yeah, That's starting to look better. pretty darn no good. No wonder the right? kids love See, this. They love Gee the, and whiz. A little cornstarch is fantastic. So cornstarch not only will thicken it, but it whitens it just a little tiny bit. And to that, we're going to add some some powdered cocoa because oh. that works as well. So see how so this that, ought to taste pretty this. good That's by the time awesome you're done. when you're all done with this. So here, take a look at this. Watch. Oh, oh, oh yeah. This is looking good. Now you have to have this. Now that looks pretty darn good. That looks good. pretty good. I have it to does. say that's pretty good. So we have to have the splatter test. So here, we'll oh. put this out here like this. Okay. And so take a look this way. We just do a little bit on there and kind of see what it looks like. So this is, this uh, does, okay, so you see how that looks a little uh, chocolatey? Yeah, a little so chocolatey So now we, we redden it just a little bit, which is just fine. And so you got to play with it. But this one here, gosh, this one looked pretty darn good. Got so this take a one look just at right. this one here. Oh, see how this looks bad yeah. that way? Oh, yeah. Because by oh, itself yeah. it does. But here, watch this on your arm. Here, i got to show you this <laughs> on one. Your so arm. So on your arm. Oh, oh, doesn't that look pretty oh. darn good? <laughs> yeah. And oh, I hope we never so see it. Oh, well. delicious so, as yeah, well. Great. Halloween so who knows blood. How really perfect. But that, gosh darn it, that does look pretty darn good. <laughs> Halloween and if you're gonna blood. Freak out the neighbors. This reminds me of a Saturday Night Live bit. <laughs> but you got to know what all those things do, and you're gonna yes, make you some do. great blood.